Hi friends. So I picked up this Fujifilm XC 15 to 45 mil for 145 US dollars. So I'm heading to Thailand next week and I knew I needed something um, really small and that has a really good wide, wide angle especially. So today I'm gonna test it out a bit for video. I've seen a lot of photo reviews and it actually looks really above average, honestly, for photos, um, but I haven't seen hardly any good video for it on the internet. Um, so hopefully today we can do something about that. So I'll shoot a few wide scenes with it here at sunset. Um, and then tomorrow do kind of a documentary style B-roll sequence at midday light to really put it through, through its paces. And make sure to watch till the end. Um, I'll share a few thoughts and what I do and don't like about it and especially the image quality. And I think I'll probably shoot a, a few photos as well so you can see, um, but this will definitely be a, a video focused review. So as you can see, the image quality looks pretty great for the price. Um, I'm really happy with it. It's tiny. Um, it was only, like, like I said, $150. Um, obviously, the bokeh is a bit lacking. Um, but again, I mean, it's a kit lens. You can't really expect too much. And I think relying on that every time to make a pretty image is it's kind of taking the easy way out. But yeah, some of, the, some of the downsides I've found are the power zoom is pretty annoying. Um, it turns, it, like, it physically zooms out every time you turn the camera on. And especially the most annoying thing is is every time you go to playback, like if I wanted to watch a clip back, it uh, it zooms in and then zooms back out. It's very strange, and it seems to draw power um, from the camera more than more than a regular lens would. It's almost too sharp for video, uh, but using a ProMist helps a bit with that. And the kind of the main downside I think is the plastic lens mount. So it's not like the strongest thing in the world, but if you're gentle with it, it should be fine. I, it seems fine. It feels pretty solid to me, but it is plastic. So hopefully you enjoyed this. Um, if you want to see more uh, camera and lens reviews, make sure to leave a comment below and subscribe. Um, I've got a, a couple more travel videos coming out soon. Um, like I said, I got this right before I'm heading to Thailand, so that should be coming up soon. And uh, yeah, thanks so much for watching, and I'll see you next time.